Another major change coming to the Harris County District Attorney's Office as the new DA, Kim Ogg, takes office on Monday. Ogg announced a new sex crimes unit today. This is a response to Channel 2's investigation into the jailing of a rape victim named Jenny. Channel 2 Investigates first exposed how a rape victim sat in jail for 27 days after having a mental breakdown on the witness stand. Harris County prosecutors under DA Devin Anderson were worried Jenny would not return to testify against her rapist. Incoming DA Kim Ogg made that issue a cornerstone of her campaign. Jenny's rape case and the plight of that individual rape victim set many things in action. In her campaign, Og promised to create a special unit of trained prosecutors to handle sex crime cases. Today she made good on that promise, appointing Joanne Music to head up the new sex crimes unit. Og says Music has trained hundreds of prosecutors and defense attorneys and has herself tried more than 100 criminal cases. Creating a separate division, the idea is to enhance services to rape victims, both adults and children, by giving them a continuing service through one DA, or as few as possible. And so it'll be a permanent division. Og also promised that no sex crime victim would ever again be jailed to ensure their testimony. Since winning the election, Og has fired dozens of prosecutors and staff in the DA's office. Among them, Nick Sosius, the prosecutor who handled Jenny's case. Jenny's case showed the service gaps in the system, how one person was mistreated uh, through a gap in services. Also today, Kim Ogg added 15 other folks to her team. Vivian King was named Chief of Staff. King has been in private practice for the past 12 years. Jim Leitner, who served in the office before and has been counsel for the Harris County Sheriff's Office, and also former Houston City Council member Sue Lovell joining Ogg's new team today.